guys, welcome back. If you're new to my channel, my name is Allie. I am a wife of four years and I have an 11 month old little boy. His name is Benjamin. And the way he eats is not a hot mess. Thankfully, he eats tons. He eats all the time. He drinks his formula good. And today I'm gonna to take you through what he eats in a day. I do not show you how much formula he eats. He usually eats about anywhere from 24 to 32 ounces of formula a day, but I'm gonna take you through the solids that he eats. He eats breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and sometimes snacks. He is a snacker and he loves snacks, so he always has a full belly. But I'm gonna take you through what he eats in a day, and I hope you guys enjoy it. Okay guys, so Benny usually starts breakfast with puffs. These are really good for him. Um, he has blueberry, strawberry, apple, and banana. Today he's eating strawberry apple. He loves them because they dissolve very quickly. This is one of the first finger foods that we had. And he loves them because they kind of tied him over while I cook his meal. And this morning he had mashed up banana, vanilla Greek yogurt, and scrambled eggs. He used to not like scrambled eggs until I started cooking them in coconut oil and he loves them. So um, I cook them in extra virgin coconut oil and he likes to feed some to the dog so he'll usually toss them to the side first and then I spoon feed him his fruit usually and his yogurt and he loves bananas and he loves yogurt. He'll eat them for snacks, he'll eat them any chance he gets. But he really used to not like textures and now he finally is starting to eat some. So if your baby doesn't like it, give them a shot um, more often than not. Just keep giving it to them and eventually they'll like it. And here he loves to feed himself his scrambled eggs. He loves um, eggs for breakfast. He usually won't eat them if I give them at lunch or supper, but at breakfast time he does love eggs. And he can usually eat half to a whole egg by himself, which that counts um, most of it being thrown into the floor. And this is the coconut oil I use. I just get it at Sam's. And he loves the taste of the coconut oil in the eggs. I don't really like coconut oil in the eggs, but I'm trying to learn so that way when I cook him eggs, I can just have what he doesn't eat. And he always gets water with his meals. Sometimes I'll add juice or some unsweetened tea or something in there, and I'll just add it with the water, and he drinks that. But usually it's just water, and he loves it. He loves these nubby cups. And he also is wanting to um, start spoon feeding himself, but usually it ends up just being a mess. So we're learning, but so far it's not so good. <laughs> And his daddy had cinnamon rolls this morning, so he had to share. Benny loves anything bread, so he loved these, and we let him make a mess, and the dog usually cleans up the mess for us. But Benny was definitely enjoying these cinnamon rolls. He actually had them for the next two mornings, so I just heated them up, and he loved them. So this is his lunch. I made him eggs again, and he did not really eat them. And then I added cheese. He loves cheese, and he loves noodles, so he ate a lot of mac and cheese. For lunch today and then that mush is a bunch of vegetables mushed up and he has gotten to where he will not eat vegetables so he did not eat any vegetables this day he ate very few of his eggs and he ate a ton of mac and cheese he loves any kind of noodle cheesy plain spaghetti anything noodle he loves he's definitely a pasta connoisseur and like i said um he has mac and cheese again he doesn't really like anything else except for noodles. <laughs> and I tried giving him whole vegetables this time to see if he would eat them, but he didn't. And he always has these little crunchies. These are his pre-supper snack. He likes all kinds. He's had the veggie dip and the cheddar and the ranch so far, and he likes all of them. But he loves, they dissolve too, not as fast as the puffs, but pretty quickly. So he'll shove the whole thing in his mouth and wallow it around and it dissolves pretty easily. So we don't have to worry about him choking or anything like that. But it just ties him over while I finish cooking his meal. And we had chili this night, so I did give him some mashed up chili beans, but he wasn't a fan. The next, a couple nights later, we had chili um, out, and he did eat the beans then. So it just had to, he had to grow on him. He um, usually doesn't like things the first couple times he tries them, but the more I try and give it to him, the more he'll eventually give in. And so far, he eats most things. He's just kind of refusing to eat vegetables at the moment. So he didn't eat a ton. He ate some mac and cheese, but he didn't like the chili beans, and he didn't like... Um, the vegetables. So I gave him one of these rice crackers. Um, he used to not be able to eat them because they break off and even though they do dissolve, they break off in big chunks. But this one is sweet potato and banana and he loves sweet potato and he loves banana. So he loves these. He'll usually eat one. I always give him two, but he usually eats one and gives one to the dog. 
His bath time is usually about 30 minutes to an hour after he eats. So for tonight, I mixed up baby rice and formula and fruit puree. And I just, I think it's pear and pineapple. And I just try to give him a snack before he goes to bed just to kind of keep his belly full so that he'll sleep good. And he did sleep good this night. He ate most of what's in that bowl. But usually at bath time, we try to get a snack in just to keep him full. All right, guys, that's it. That's what Benjamin eats in a day. He's been eating that since about the time he was nine months, and I'm sure it will change after he turns a year old because he's getting more and more of an appetite. But from about nine to 12 months, that's what he's been eating, and he is a good eater. We keep trying new foods all the time, and so he's learning new things that he loves all the time. He does love fruit. He used to love vegetables, not so much anymore, and he definitely loves pasta. That is without a doubt. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up if you did. It really supports my channel. And hit subscribe. I'd love for you to be part of our YouTube family. I do videos as often as I can. And I hope you guys come back soon. Thanks for watching.